All right, employing cutting edge technology in the kitchen, there's a supercomputer that somehow knows how to make our mouths water. And as you will see in a moment, there is a twist that even has chefs amazed. Fox 5's Carrie Drew serves up this month's big idea. These chefs at the Institute of Culinary Education in Chelsea are cooking up something new, something different something revolutionary. We're breaking new ground in the kitchen here. We are putting together ingredients and creating flavors in ways that no one has ever done before. Chefs James Brichion and Michael Lasconis are creating a Filipino tomato salad with ingredients they've never used together. Dried chili pepper, paprika. The idea tomato, came from a computer. Shoots. This is Watson. You may remember Watson from Jeopardy back in 2011. What is pentathlon? Yes. The so-called supercomputer beat two former champs. Watson is powered by cognitive technology that processes information more like a human than a computer. It's doing everything from coming up with cancer treatments, or in this case, coming up with recipes. So Florian, this is Watson. Mm -hmm. This is it. We've gathered information about ingredients and the flavor compounds that they contain, as well as the nutrition facts. And putting all that together, we can help people discover new food pairings or new recipes that have never been seen before. Florian Pinnell is a software engineer from IBM, and he's also a trained chef. He combined his two passions to come up with a cognitive cooking project. On Jeopardy, Watson took the form of this massive system, but here, Chef Watson is on a laptop. Well, first you're going to choose an ingredient. See, it's asking you what's your favorite ingredient. Florian decides on a key ingredient, tomato. Then, a cuisine. And I think today we've picked Filipino. Next, Florian decides he wants Chef Watson to come up with a salad. He then customizes it, and when he's done, Chef Watson goes to work. The next step is when really the magic happens, and we look at all the possible combinations, the millions, billions, trillions of possible combinations for tomato salad. Chef Watson comes up with these original recipes with the help of flavor compound algorithms, or how well the ingredients work together. So we found you know, some amazing combinations. We, we've stumbled upon some dishes that, that I never thought would make any sense, combining uh, you know, pork belly with cottage cheese and dill and cheddar cheese and, and green peas and sweet peppers. There's also data on how surprising or unique the dish is and how well it tastes. And this technology is not just for skilled chefs. Soon Chef Watson could be helping you in your own kitchen. The idea that you can say, oh, I have this, this and that and I, and I don't want to have this, give me some direction, is you know, absolutely innovative and is, is absolutely not something that exists. Stacy Rivera is the digital director for Bon Appetit. The company is currently testing a web app that's spicing things up in the food world. This is Chef Watson with Bon Appetit. It analyzes the roughly 9,000 recipes in the Bon Appetit database to come up with new and exciting combinations. This is not a recipe app. Recipe apps have a finite amount of information and this is an infinite way to play. The app is still in its beta version but should be available by the end of the year. And while Chef Watson may be the future of how recipes are created, Everyone seems to agree technology can't do everything. At the end of the day, it's still the human who tastes. It's really our creativity on display, and the computer is just helping us be creative, and I, and I think that's always a, a great thing. And by the way, as for the Filipino tomato salad... It smells delicious. Yes. And Chef Watson says it will taste delicious. That's right. And if it doesn't, it's his fault, not mine. <laughs> Chef Watson can rest easy. The dish, like so many others, is a big hit. Really good. In Chelsea, Carrie Drew, Fox 5 News.